birthday to you. Happy birthday to my mom. Happy birthday to you. Good morning from our beautiful villa in Bali. I can't wait to see you guys around this place a little later, but I'll see my mom is enjoying a cup of coffee in our little sitting area. I got up at like 7.30 a.m. and I've been enjoying this. Oh my gosh, it's too early. early. <laughs> no, it's beautiful out here. We're outside right now, my mom is here in the bathroom. She has no idea that food and breakfast is being set up. Thank you. Where, what is this? Oh, you breakfast! You're not going to breakfast? No! I told you to put on a suit. We have floating oh, breakfast. Wow. <laughs> oh my it was good gosh. timing that I was vlogging. Happy birthday! Thank you. I wish I can take the cup out, Bob. <laughs> my mom is shocked and documenting our floating pool experience. Happy birthday to you. Thank Happy you. birthday to you. Thank Happy you. Happy birthday. Wow, I don't know how we're eating all of this. I don't know, you guys. I just said for two people, and look at it's all of this food. For an entire family. I know. Oh, we're so in beautiful. our bathing suits. We're gonna get in our little pool and have some breakfast. Yeah. It is actually so hot out here, which truly is perfect for what we want to do. But we're gonna relax in the pool, maybe take some photos and videos for TikTok and Instagram, and just have a good breakfast. My mom kept asking, she's like, "What are we eating for breakfast?" We were like, "Do you think we missed breakfast?" And I was like, "Just wait, the food's coming at 10 o'clock." Gotta make the birthday special, so this is just surprise number one of the day. <laughs> She just got a little pancake happy birthday delivered with singing. I caught it on my phone. Why does it keep biting back up? An eternal wish. How many wishes can I have? Happy birthday! Surprise number two of the day, although I had honestly no idea this is when it was coming. Oh, as was Breakfast, <laughs> go ahead. Breakfast okay. pancakes, they say happy birthday on the plate. Oh I just said totally wrong. It's my mom's birthday. Is there anything you can do? And they said, well, we do this thing where we bring pancakes. And I said, okay, perfect. Breakfast, pancakes. Wonderful. So they just came and sang and dropped it off. Mm. Yum. I'm so full. We just put on some cover-ups and little dresses. We want to walk around and explore the resort. We got in last night super late, like 11 p.m. by the time it took us to get here from the airport. It's like an hour and a half drive up to Ubud, where we are. And so we put on our dresses because we want to go explore. We do have a spa treatment appointment at 1 p.m. today. We have a two and a half hour spa treatment here at the resort. Something that we planned for my mom's birthday, paid for by me and my sisters as a birthday gift for my mom. And so we are going to have that a little later today, but before that, we're gonna walk around for the resort. We thought maybe we would go to the gym, but it's time for a day off since it's my mom's birthday. And we're just going to enjoy ourselves. I don't think I mentioned it already, but we're staying at the Desa Visa. Desa Visa? Honestly, I need to ask them how to pronounce it. D-E-S-A-V-I-S-E-S-A. -S 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 Happy birthday to you. So far, this has been an amazing start to my birthday. <laughs> Yay! Just missing my, my man. My man? My man. Oh. Yeah, I'm missing my She FaceTimed him at least, what, two or three times already today? I don't know. I miss my man, but it's not my birthday. I am going to get my shoes. Oh, my shoes yeah. are right here. We're going to grab okay. our shoes and come on, let's go around the resort. Bye-bye. Or come along with. Here's what the villa looks like from the outside. So beautiful. We're just going to walk around and see what we can find. See what's going on. We have discovered the flower garden where it looks like they're planting some things out here. Oh, I think I see the rice field up ahead. It is. Oh, wow. Beautiful. We have discovered the swimming pool. Wow. Beautiful. Oh, the pH balance of the pool is a 7.6. Wow, beautiful. This is seriously stunning. And look at all the carvings built into the back of the pool wall. Wow. Color of the water, everything. Here's where we checked in last night. We'll kind of show you that little hut. 
lots of places to eat. They do breakfast up here every morning. Obviously, we did the floating breakfast today, so we didn't eat up here. There's so much more this way. Oh my goodness. Wow. Okay, let's do it. Look at the flower coming off of this lily pad. Got rice fields over here. All kinds of greener. It's just like, it's just so tranquil. I don't even know. Yes, tranquil is a good word. Yes, our little swing here with the name. Here's the name of the hotel. I think it's Vicesa. Vicesa, yeah. Seems right. Wow. So many little places to sit and enjoy. There's a bar somewhere. You see a sign for the cave spa? No idea if this is where we're going later. Oh! Oh! No way! No way! I wonder if this is where we're gonna be. I have no idea. Oh my gosh! This is awesome. This is the cave spa. This is the main entrance that leads out to the road, but I wanted to come out here to show you guys the entrance. Wow. Truly, truly, truly a stunning resort. I will leave the links to everything in the description. I'm not being paid, I'm not working with this hotel. I just happened to find it online. Well, not happen. After lots of research, found it online and we love it so far. Also, it's so sweet because everybody that we've talked to at the resort, our taxi driver, everybody said, thank you so much for coming to Bali. They're still recovering from the pandemic. He said, thank you for your tourism, we need it. And so I just think that that's so sweet. Even the resort was just telling us that they really opened up, what, last summer? So the middle it's, of last year. Yeah, the middle of last year. So they're still, you know, doing renovations and prepping for people. And we're like, we had no idea. I mean, this is pretty perfect to us. But they're so grateful for tourism. So if you're thinking about it, the answer is absolutely yes. Okay, so we just cleaned up the room a little bit. I want to give you a little room tour before anything else happens. Here's the suite we're staying in, number 715. Arjuna, Arjuna, I'm not positive. Positive, but you walk in the front doors here, which I love. And you're greeted by this water feature. It sounds amazing at night. These little stepping stones across the water into this little sitting area. Got a mini fridge under there, a coffee maker, all sorts of amenities, fresh fruit. There's so many cool different types of fruit, including snake fruit over here. And it leads out over to our private pool. Not gonna lie, this pool was a little chilly this morning, but this is where we had our floating breakfast. And then around the side, we chose the garden view. So we just have a view of beautiful plants and two little lounge chairs. Then through the sliding glass doors into the room, it's a king size bed. It's got a canopy, super tall ceilings. They even left us a little welcome gift got a TV over here on this side, nightstands, wardrobe, slippers, and pajamas. And then through this door, we have the bathroom, toilet, obviously, and this wonderful shower. As you can tell, this is outdoor. We have a bathtub right here, and then our dual sink. And this is our one bedroom villa tour. Holy moly, we are in love. So how much do you think a suite like this costs? Well, let me tell you, we're paying just about 300 US dollars a night to stay in this beautiful villa. I definitely splurged a little, obviously in Bali, you can go on the cheaper side, but it is my mother's birthday and my dad and I decided that we were gonna do something super special to blow her out of the water. And I'm pretty sure that this absolutely did the trick. All jewelry is off, we are getting ready for our spa treatment. My mom said, you're taking a break, no filming. So I'm listening to the birthday girl and we are gonna go relax for two and a half hours. I'm sure we will debrief you guys after we're done, but let's go have your birthday spa treatment. Yes. We're back from the spa. I just took a shower and put on a robe. My oh. mom has washed her hair. And we got a special delivery. Who would have thought? <laughs> we had a bottle of wine delivered to our room so that we could well, enjoy it. Well, it is somebody's it. birthday. Oh, is it now? Yeah, it's like, I think from this region. So lovely. White velvet, refreshing and zesty from Indonesia. Wonderful Indonesia. So we're gonna do a wine taste test because we still have three hours until dinner. Wow, I can hear so much better from the ears out. Ta-da! Oh, interesting, Cheers, happy birthday! 
Thank you. Oh, okay. It doesn't even taste like wine. It's yes. like juice. Well, that's well, not good. It's not good. <laughs> it tastes like juice. Well, it's perfect. It is good. It's light, delicious. Yes. And I'm going to go have a photo shoot in our um, bathtub with it. So, cheers. We have finished the entire bottle of wine. It went down like water with a little bit of flavoring, so we're a little bit nervous. But it's my mom's birthday, so not so stressed for the day. Now we are getting ready. I just blow dried my hair because it was a little wet, but I am going to curl it for tonight because of what we're doing tomorrow. We're playing with elephants tomorrow at an elephant sanctuary rescue, and I could not be more excited. I don't know if that's going to be on here or just on Instagram and TikTok, so just make sure that you're updated on everything so that you know where to go look for that. Anyway, I'm going to curl my hair, put on some makeup, and then we're gonna get ready and dressed. I'm wearing a dress that I bought in the south of France this past summer. So pretty from this boutique, and that is going to be the dinner outfit. We're figuring out how to place the music on the TV. And we're gonna get ready in our beautiful outdoor bathroom here in Bali. I can't even believe that I'm saying that, to be honest. I wanted to come to Bali for so long. I already texted my boyfriend. I said, we're coming here next year, the year after. We're staying way longer than five nights. And we just have to do it all. We're in Ubud, which is basically like rice field place. We're not even anywhere near the beach. We're gonna do a beach day for us, but I'm just like, no, no, no. Like, I need to come back to Bali and I need to have at least a couple weeks in every city. And I just love it so far. So if you're thinking about Bali, the answer is yes, do it. Just go. Once you get here, everything is relatively inexpensive, at least from the US. And I'm so happy that we were able to work this into our schedule to come here. All right, we're getting ready to go to dinner. I curled my hair, I curled my mom's hair. She's putting on some mascara right now. I dress is from a boutique in South France, like I mentioned. Love it, my mom's is from TJ Maxx. TJ Maxx. Just got little teeny tiny heels on. We didn't bring anything big for this trip. Just one pair that we said, if we're gonna go out to dinner, let's just throw on those, and that's what we're wearing. Both of ours are Dolce Vita. But we are getting ready to go to dinner. We have a reservation at 7.30 at the Lumberg restaurant, so let's go eat some good food. I think we previewed the menu, but they didn't really clarify if that's actually what we're eating tonight or not. We might just have to see what's going on there. We haven't eaten since breakfast. We are, I'm I'm still honestly kind of full from breakfast. I had like three croissants and all kinds of eggs and bacon and everything. I, I ate so much. I did. And we are very excited to see some when actual you're 52, dinner. When you can't eat three croissants. <laughs> you could and you should. It's your birthday. Just had some pancakes. Want, I had one with honey and everything else. I just did not eat three. It feels like we have this whole resort to ourselves. We've seen a couple of people here, but for the most part, we're just walking along to dinner. Not a soul in sight. Although I did try and reserve us a romantic dinner in the rice fields tonight. Kind of late, honestly. And uh, somebody had taken it. They're like, it's not available. So people are here. Yeah, I don't really see them. Dinner tonight is at Lumbung Restaurant. Pretty traditional Indonesian food from what I've heard. Here's the entrance. Oh my goodness, lots of stairs. Ooh, pretty. Oh my goodness. Sorry. Thank you. That's all right. That's a Happy birthday. <laughs> Very pretty with all the rose petals on the ground. Thank you so much. You're welcome. There was a little bit of confusion on our table, but they figured it out. They've been so nice and apologetic. And like, it does not matter that much, but cheers. Cheers. This Happy is beautiful. birthday. Thank you so it much. It is. And we've got a nice view. I love you. You. I love you too. Oh, look. The water's on the top. Yeah. Called a romantic dinner, but I asked them, I was like, it's mom's birthday, what can we do? <laughs> there are so many rose petals all over the floor. Served with the baby potato and then orange chili, pickle cucumber. So what he was explaining is that we have pan seared king prawn, aka shrimp, and it has citrus, pickled cucumber, mint salad, and like an orange chili vinaigrette. So this is going to be delicious. For our soup, we got a seafood soup. We're not 100% sure on this one. It does have shrimp in it, but also like mussels and different things. But we are going to try because this is a set menu for this dinner. We also just got I can cocktails because they messed up our reservation. They gave us another cocktail, which was so sweet. And a little piece of bread, looks like olives and cheese and tomatoes. But we're gonna have some soup now. Got our main course, which is a beef tenderloin, mashed potatoes, mixed vegetables, demi-glaze sauce. It honestly looks too pretty to eat. And finally for dessert, we asked for just one because we didn't want to waste any. So this is vanilla tiramisu and we're just gonna share it for dessert. We're very full. I have a lot of food. <laughs> I'm so full. And I hate to waste things and send it back. Yeah. So he's like, can you just bring one Miko so that we can share it? So we're gonna share this little tiramisu. We are so 
full. We need to walk off our food back to the room. Mm. This bed is so comfortable. I think both of us are so excited to go to bed. We just put on our PJs after a little walk. After dinner, we walked around the resort a little bit to help digest our food because we're so full. <laughs> Take two. We're getting excited for a very, very, very fun day tomorrow, which will not be a part of this vlog. But happy birthday! It's only our birthday. Not this one. They're gonna have to subscribe down below so that they don't miss oh, whatever it is. But it will be on the vlog. Maybe it might just be on TikTok or Instagram. You might just it's have to follow me on to there to make my sure. personal arsenal of photos. Yeah. <laughs> gonna go Delicious. play with Thank elephants you. tomorrow. Dinner was beautiful. It was. It was and so was, romantic. It was. <laughs> We're such a cute couple. <laughs> for friendship. <laughs> <laughs> that was a massage. I know. For what friendship. Did you say? Uh, the massage that we got today was good for honeymooners or friendship. Friendship or so honeymooners, honeymoon anniversary or friendship. <laughs> anyway, I'm gonna take my contacts out and brush my teeth and we are getting to bed. I'm just honestly so tired and an early morning and long day tomorrow. So, but anyway, thank you so much for tuning into my mom's birthday vlog here in Bali. I know that she had a wonderful day and I'm glad that we kind of got to bring you guys along. It's the first really, really genuinely true chill day that we've had this whole trip and probably the chillest day I've had in my life this year. Most likely, <laughs> I don't really give myself a lot of chill time. So it's nice to just be able to have like a little spa treatment and hang out and the floating breakfast and the dinner. Didn't really work too much today, although I always work every day, but not too much today because we try not to be on our phones as much. Anyway, all that to say, I love you guys so much. We are getting to bed and I will see you in the next one. Love you. Bye.